感觉真的还蛮不错的，有点像一个小小饼干的感觉。When you're opening it out and you're consuming that content, it's just incredible. So the, the visual cues coming from social media, videos, even the audio quality, it's just incredible. So I think as we break the boundaries of new technologies, new form factors, we'll find consumers use it in different ways. We'll find content providers provide their content in different ways to adapt to the use case. So the good thing for us at Samsung is we're providing these tools to bring the whole industry forwards and then everyone else can come with us, so it's really exciting. Just a regular man, just a regular man. Just, yeah, we are here today, or we are going to do some Google Store, or we are going to do some Google Store, or we are going to do some Google Store. What we found is that there are maybe different use cases outside of that environment where issues could arise. Um, so we've been working really closely for the last three months with our engineering team to look at further ways we can continue to enhance the design without compromising its slimness, without compromising its look and feel, but providing even more durability for that day-to-day -day use. Certainly with the, the product that we've got, the excitement that we've seen today when we're launching it, when consumers get that in their hands to be able to experience it for themselves, they'll soon forget about anything they've heard before and see the beauty and the joy of this new product. And we're going to have many more to come in the future to build off the back of this. So we're just excited to see where this takes us. I think the big screen is an exciting development and what it offers is a whole new device diversity in design and that's something that we really need in the smartphone space but at a $2,000 premium price point how many people are really prepared to go out and buy one particularly with the quality problems we've seen is going to be a big question. When Samsung's Galaxy Fold first broke Calver in February, everyone was super excited about it and all the technology enthusiasts wanted to go out and get one, despite the high price. I'm worried that perhaps now, given the delays, given the problems, people will be a little more nervous. However, when you get the product in your hand, I have to tell you, it does feel lovely and it really is the ultimate kind of technology gadget bling on the market right now.